Hey guys, how y'all doing? Good morning, good evening, good afternoon to all those around the world. Welcome back to another Dead by Daylight video featuring your girl Spirit. Come at you the very, very festive Spirit build today in the form of Nurses Calling. We're playing Gift of Pain, Franklin's Demise, and Jolt, in which I'm having so much fun with this build, by the way. Like, it is so good, the fact that everybody and their brother is running items. You know, Franklin's Demise really just shuts that down. On top of that, with Jolt, with Gift of Pain, Nurses Calling, it is so spicy. But either way, I'd like to go ahead and say thank you guys. I appreciate you for staying positive, giving a lot of feedback for the last video when it came to Strider. Really appreciate it. Hopefully, we're going to have a lot more discussion videos coming forward. Either way, remember, smash the like button. Make sure to subscribe for future content. Let's get into this game. All right, guys, here we go. Diving into a very, very uh, irritating map for me. But it is what it is. It's not very festive either. Very unfortunate for me. Overall, we're taking Jolt, Gift of Pain, Franklin's Demise, and Nurse's Calling. This build is super, super good. I'm having a lot of fun with it as of late. Especially with Franklin's. Like, I don't normally use Franklin's a lot, let alone with Spirit or any other killer. But considering all these survivors are just bringing nothing but items pretty much to all your games, you might as well make use of Franklin's because it's very, very good still. Did she drop down? No, she did not drop down. I guess that's my bad. We did see her go up there, but I just assumed she was going to come down like they always do. That's fine. She's still up? No, she is not. All right, let's get out of here. Ooh, sounds like a generator's being worked on here. Who's this? A friend. Never mind. Hold on, guys. We got this. Wait, wait, wait. Hello, friend. Where are we going? Out the window. Okay. We cannot entertain this chase too much. She does have a pretty good loop here. In which he should have just backed out through the window as well. Yep, cool. Let's get rid of this door and get out because we got to go over to that gen. And resume. Who's this? Nice. I did see someone healing over there with Nurse's Calling. We should be able to stop that. I just really wanted that flashlight there. Thankfully, she did not get her healing off in time. And we get to interrupt it as well. Come here, Meg. Double jolt value. We'll take it. Go get your girl. Um. Okay. Her sound effect literally just disappeared. I'm gonna have to watch that back later. Like it just I don't know where it went. Either she just double backed or it's very well played, I'm not sure. It just it just woof. Hola Chiquita. I'll deal with you in a second. It's weird though, because she would have doubled back, we would have saw her, or at least saw the blood trail, what have you, or heard her, or whatever. We were going back to pick this one up. Claudette, what are we doing here? That feeling when you get stuck. <laughs> Not much I can do about that. I'm sorry. You got Death Heart? Nope. We'll take the jolt value, though. All right, where'd the other girl go? She looks like she healed up. She might have came back for a flashlight. Not sure. Because it's not here anymore. Oh. All right. All right. I didn't anticipate her to be there. I just kind of swung. It is what it is. We do lose her, but we do also take her flashlight here as well. And my hand bugged out there. I know y'all saw that. <laughs> Gotta use your ears a little bit, guys. Goodness. Let's get you hooked up. Unfortunately, there's not another scourge hook in this area, which I would love for her to be on right now. Considering, you no, know, she's doing she's doing pretty good. But overall, it's not really much else we can do. Did she just like Kobe off that hook? Wow, she did. Okay, hold on. I don't think we're going to catch her, though. Maybe not. So close. I kind of wanted to hold it for a split second, because I think she still had borrowed time up, but there's not really much else we could have done there. Let's go and get rid of this totem and see if we can make it back over there to the hook to stop the healing. Insinuating, that's what they're going to be doing. What we got? Friends? Nice. You can take another nap. Thank you for the jolt value. Appreciate it. Where are we going, bud? Let me get that hit, please. Oh, really good. Well played. All right, all right. We got the flashlight and everything. Look at this guy. Okay, can we stop the whole twirling around trees and stuff? Thanks for the flashlight. Get out of here, man. Go about your day. Hold on. Grass movement here. Wow. Yeah, that just happened, guys. Just happened. Very, very solid. Well played, guy. That dude's gone, man. 
Oh. Hello. Newcomer often. She must love the cat and mouse, I swear. But I think we're gonna have to end this one. Never mind, she has a pallet. Excuse me. We're gonna have to let her go. And get back over there to this hook. Or not the hook, but the survivor that got picked up. They might get her healed up before we get there, but we might be able to stop it. Nice, let's go. Take another nap. That's right, Claudette, it just happened. Keep moving. None to see here, folks. Still got four gens left, man. Three hooks, we're doing well. All right, so she healed up as well. Claudette, you gotta look behind you, you silly goober. This build, man, I swear, guys, it's pretty spicy. So we know that she doesn't have um, Unbreakable, which is pretty good, right? So in other words, their team have to come past me to get these two out of this area, which I'm cool with because we have two gens over here that we can actually protect as well. So not really losing a lot being over here. Now she does have Shaq ahead of her, in which there is no pallet if she goes towards the, that way again. So I'm not really worried about it, but I don't want to go to Shaq. Also, we have to make sure we keep our pressure up. So as long as she stays injured, she'll go around and heal herself on totems and all that sort of thing, which is cool with me. She's got no med kit. This is what I want to see right here. Double survivors healing up. Nice dead heart. Because at the end of the day, this build really calls for it sometimes, especially when you have so much pressure. When you guys can are able to play on top of your scourge hooks like this. Because most survivors will just heal underneath hooks, right? <laughs> And they'll realize that just one survivor trying to heal me before spirit or whatever killer gets to me, it's not going to work out. You know what I mean? There we go. Make sure you have uh, the hemorrhage and mangled as well. No items left here. And we're also running that, uh, what do you call that item or add-on that basically blocks out two chests from the map. So it also lowers down their chances of getting items as well. Which is pretty good. Who we got over here? Friend. Huh, guess not. It looks like they got Claudette off the hook here. This gen in this area might pop, but I don't want to spend too much time here because I know there's two survivors over here. Like, I know where they're at. I swear I thought I heard a snowman. Maybe I did. But we have three survivors here. I'm not going to go chase down a snowman when I have three other people that I can be getting. There you go. Go be injured again. That's right. Run off. Hear yourself. Um, where's she going here? Hello? I think that should have hit you, but okay. Like, just the bridge of your coat, or the end of your coat? I think I should have got it. You're not gonna spin me again, buddy. I understand how you play now. Hold up. Yeah, he's above me. That sucks. I think he went into the snowman up on the top stairs, but I don't really care all too much. Especially when this gen is about to be popped here. Oh, friend. You come here often. That must be terrifying when you think about it. It's like, oh, hi. Where are we going? You do have a pallet here, but you went the wrong direction. Unless you make it to this one. Never mind. Unless you might have had dead hard. A lot of survivors, if you notice, they like dead hard through pallets. You can't really just cancel the animation. You have to finish it up, right? So I anticipated her to actually dead hard through the pallet. So it is what it is. Hopefully you enjoy this one. Now you can be uh, slower for your, slow down your healing progression as well. It's like your boy healed up. I hate this loot, man. I really do. He does have a window here and another wall, so this is not a good area for me to be in here. And a snowman. He's on the other side here. There we go. Nice job. Claudette, let me get that injured, please. Thank you. Go ahead. Run on. You got it. The best thing about it, I know there's no totems over there for them to heal up, so. But your girl over here, she seems like she lit another one. I'll watch you eat them. I think that's it for you, right? Thanks for playing? I'm not sure. Alright, there's a pop another gen behind me here. She's out of the game. I'm just gonna take a peek over here and see if they went this direction or not. No, okay. I guess that would have been the play, considering there's another gen there, but I guess they decided to go in a different direction. But it's okay. Thanks for the notification. 
Wow, that's unfortunate. How do you miss a skill check? Girl, are you not paying attention? Well, she was tunneling hard on that heal. She must have been almost done. Maybe that's what it was. I'll see you later. Thanks for playing. We got two left. Unfortunately, he's still alive, and I have to hook him. I have, at least I have to catch him, you know? And then we have one hook for Meg. That's about it. But this is going to be the one that's probably going to give me the most trouble. Chill, 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 chill. Nice. That works almost every time, I swear. The best thing about it is the generator is also going off, so it might have been harder for him to hear me. Nice. Might have been harder for him to hear me there. Now we have a scourge hook with your name on it. I think this is his first hook of the game, isn't it? Yeah, it is. He's been doing that well, not gonna lie. Hold up. Oh, I just eat that. You better get that man off the hook. You better run. Come on, you gotta be quicker than that. Okay, Alright. Oh, that was good. That was really good. I did not anticipate that. She dead hearted into me to get him off the hook. That was very well played. You're, up, you're about to be out of options here, bud. Nice. I think the totem kind of threw him off here as well. But that's gonna be that's gonna be it, guys. It was pretty good. Nice little spicy build. Let me know how it does for you. I've been having a lot of fun with this. Anything with you know Franklin's as of late with Sloppy Butcher and or Gift of Pain, it's just doing so solid. But overall, this has been Pause Blaze. Remember to smash that like button. Make sure you're subscribed for future spirit content. And by the way, do not get on Santa's naughty list.